hi welcome back in this video i will show you how to draw a realistic glossy lip and we are starting right now now using an hb pencil shade the lips to bring out the form all the materials i used for this drawing are on the description then the second step is to like this video it's going to make your drawings look super realistic of course i'm kidding <laughs> please like and subscribe now use the soft charcoal pencil to shade the very dark shadows use a makeup brush to blend the shadows Use a sable brush dipped in charcoal powder and add layers to the lips. Make sure to reduce the excess charcoal residue on the brush before applying to your drawings so you won't end up making the tone too dark. While adding the layers, study your reference to observe the tonal values. That is the highlights, mid-tones, and the shadows. Don't add the details and highlights yet until you are done with the layering. Repeat the same step on the lower lip. Small brushes are for intricate areas, while the larger ones are for large areas. At this point, I know it will be tempting to start adding the highlights and details, but wait till you are done layering. Make sure you reshade the areas which has lost its tonal form. Use a flat sable brush to detail the teeth. Please never draw the teeth as outlines. It makes the teeth look rigid and unrealistic. Know that no matter how white a teeth is, it has tonal value. Same applies to the eyes. Add the darker details with a medium charcoal pencil.
blend the lines with your small brush Since I don't have the Mono Zero eraser yet, I use the eraser on the pencil to add the highlights. I've been using it and it does wonders for me. Add the highlight according to the contours. Make sure to continuously clean the tip of the eraser to have excellent highlights. Add all the details according to the contours. If you don't apply your highlights and details according to the contours, your joints will end up looking flat. I'm sure you don't want that, so take your time when you get to this point. Spend time on your highlights because the secret to realistic drawings is in the highlights and details. What makes the lips to look glossy is the highlights, so treat your highlights as important. Step back and study your drawing if you haven't gotten what you want or not. Add the finishing touch to conclude the drawing. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and let us know in the comments. But the thing is, it doesn't end here. You still have a lot to learn. Do this. Click on the video that appeared on your screen and watch that. Yes, that. <laughs> and I will see you on the next one. Peace out.